After taking some time off, I've decided to come back and start with book reviews and see where things go from there. So today's book review is going to be a short one because my phone battery is dying. So I'll see how long I can do this before my phone kicks me off. I didn't realize it until I got outside to chore that my phone was that low. So, but the first book I'm going to start with is called Charming Artemis by Sarah M. Eden. And this was one that, in my opinion, and I'm sure others, is that this book is the conclusion to the John Quill and the Lancaster families, and that now we are moving on to the rest of the gents. And this is the youngest of both families that were thrown together by some circumstances that were <laughs> that were funny. And the Artemis, the, both characters have things happen. I'm trying to think of everything to say about this book. And I'm getting all tongue-tied and my train's going off, train of thought's going off the rails. But both characters have things happen in their past that make them feel the way that they do at, at the time. And when they're thrown together and they are forced to get married, they kind of take those things that happened to them and they hold on to them for a time being but then they slowly become friends and then they slowly blossom into other. Artemis is more like a headstrong person that puts on a show, doesn't let people see things. Charlie I feel is more laid back. He doesn't really want to be noticed. He wants to be kind of He's more happy to live in the country instead of living in England at the time. And so they get thrown together. And every time they take a few steps forward, it's a step back. Or they learn something and are able to continue going forwards with things. And like I said, it is the end. And now I feel like I'm excited for... I'm kind of sad. I feel sad that it's the end for both families, but I'm excited for the next book, and I'm, which I'm hoping that comes from her, is a book with the Gents series. I did a review on that one, which was Forget Me Not, the first book in that series, which my phone is starting to die now, so thanks for watching, and I know this was awkward. I hope I made sense, and I will see you in the next book review. Bye, guys.